twins are more likely to be born early, often before 38 weeks, so it's important to understand your birth options. Less than one in every two twin pregnancies continues beyond 37 weeks. Because of the likelihood that your babies will be born early, there is a good chance one or both of them will spend some time in the special care ward in hospital. As twins are often born early, it's a good idea to discuss with your midwife or doctor where you should give birth. You should also talk about whether you would prefer a vaginal or cesarean birth. Your doctor or midwife will most likely advise you to give birth in a hospital because there's a higher chance of complications with a twin birth. It's common for more medical staff to be involved in the birth of twins, such as a midwife, an obstetrician, and two pediatricians, one for each baby. While the process of labor is the same as when single babies are born, twin babies are more closely monitored. To do this, an electronic monitor and a scalp clip might be fitted on the first baby once your waters have broken. You will be set up with a drip, in case it is needed later. About one in three of all twin births are vaginal births. The birth process is similar to giving birth to a single baby. If you're planning a vaginal birth, your health team may recommend that you have an epidural for pain relief. This is because, if there are problems, it's easier and quicker to assist the delivery when the mother already has good pain relief. If the first twin is in a head-down position, cephalic, it's usual to consider having a vaginal birth. However, there may be other medical reasons why this would not be possible. If you have had a previous cesarean section, discuss with your doctor whether you should have a vaginal birth with twins. If you have a vaginal birth, you may need an assisted birth, which is when a suction cup, vento use, or forceps are used to help you birth your babies. Once your first baby is born, the midwife or doctor will check the position of your second baby. They do this by feeling your abdomen, tummy, and doing a vaginal examination. If your second baby is in a good position, your waters will be broken and your baby should be born soon after the first, as the cervix is already fully dilated. If contractions stop after your first birth, hormones will be added to your drip to restart them. In this video our beautiful queen hear her twin breach at home successfully, let us take a look at how she does this with the support of her medical team. Birth affirmations are positive statements about yourself and the birth process. Their purpose is to remind you of a truth that will help you reach your goal of a positive birth experience. And so I would like you to hone in on the once that feels good for you as we say these birth affirmations together. This is the day I've been waiting for. I am ready. My mind is relaxed. My body is relaxed. I trust my body. I trust my baby. I trust my birth. I am safe. My baby is safe. I am created to do this. Each contraction is bringing my baby closer to meeting me. I listen to my body. My baby and I are working together. My body knows just what to do and I trust it. Open, surrender. I can, I will. I accept and welcome labor. I can do it because I am doing it. I can't go around it, I have to go through it. One word at a time. Trust, open, relax. I am surrounded by love and so is my baby. Be here. Breathe in ability. Breathe out resistance. I will never have to do that contractions again. Every contraction brings me closer to my baby. Women all over the world are birthing with me right now. My body opens, my mind quiets, my baby descends. My instincts can be trusted and lead me to my baby. 
It is my birthright to enjoy my birth. With each contraction, I say goodbye to the part of me that could not do it. I am stronger than I ever imagined. I have a voice and a choice. My body knows what it is doing. I was made for this. I focus on right here, right now. One at a time. Sink into it. Fear is a liar. My body is capable and strong. Each wave has a purpose. Ride the waves. I can do this because I am doing it. It can't last forever. Babies always come. My contractions can never be stronger than me. They are me. I can do anything for 10 seconds. Count to 10. Repeat. When I feel I cannot do it, I know I am close. Pain is part of the process. I let it be. I know it will be over soon. I welcome surges. I don't fight against them. I look for the breaks and sink into them. Pain is power. Pain is progress. Pain brings my baby to me. There is nothing to fear. She believed she could and so she did. Change makes change. With every contraction, I reach through heaven and hell, life and death and bring new life to this world. My body achieves what my mind believes. I am ready to meet my baby. A baby will come out of my vagina. I keep breathing. I keep relaxing. I listen to my body. Baby is going to be here very soon. She is turning a corner. I slow down and take my time to keep my body safe. I want to meet my baby now. is the day I've been waiting for. I am ready. My mind is relaxed. My body is relaxed. I trust my body. I trust my baby. I trust my birth. I am safe. My baby is safe. I am created to do this. Each contraction is bringing my baby closer to meeting me. I listen to my body. My baby and I are working together. My body knows just what to do and I trust it. Open, surrender. I can, I will. I accept and welcome labor. I can do it because I am doing it. I can't go around it. I have to go through it. One word at a time. Trust, open, relax. I am surrounded by love and so is my baby. Be here. Breathe in ability. Breathe out resistance. I will never have to do that contractions again. Every contraction brings me closer to my baby. Women all over the world are birthing with me right now. My body opens, my mind quiets, my baby descends. My instincts can be trusted and lead me to my baby. It is my birthright to enjoy my birth. With each contraction, I say goodbye to the part of me that could not do it. I am stronger than I ever imagined. I have a voice and a choice. My body knows what it is doing. I was made for this. I focus on right here, right now. One at a time.
sink into it. Fear is a liar. My body is capable and strong. Each wave has a purpose. Ride the waves. I can do this because I am doing it. It can't last forever. Babies always come. My contractions can never be stronger than me. They are me. I can do anything for 10 seconds. Count to 10. Repeat. When I feel I cannot do it, I know I am close. Pain is part of the process. I let it be. I know it will be over soon. I welcome surges. I don't fight against them. I slow down and take my time to keep my body safe. I want to meet my baby now. Congratulations to our mom here and her medical team, they have done superb. Congratulations in advance to you watching, I wish you the best in your next birthing experience. See you in another video, bye.